In your Commitment 2024 coverage, voters in Jackson County faced huge lines today. This view from News Chopper 9 shows the line wrapping around the courthouse in downtown Independence. And a look at this. This is in Lee Summit, where voters say they stood in line for hours to cast their in-person absentee ballot. KMBC 9's Andy Alcock joined them in that way today. He's near Lake Tacoma speaking to voters in line. And I just can't believe I waited three hours. Some voters waited up to four hours as a seemingly endless line crept along all day. Got through it. Mark and Linda Cunningham voted early for the first time because they're going on a cruise. Today was not their first attempt. We thought we'd take off work today and we actually thought we'd get here early, but the lines were still pretty long. Hey, go vote! While hundreds and hundreds of people found the early voting location, we were just going to check it out. Some voters, like Clay Martin, showed up at Fleming Meeting Hall. There's no voting here. The polling place earlier this week. We're leaving today to go to Colorado. So we thought we'd swing by and see if we could vote before we got out of town. We got Fleming. Unfortunately, they'd had three days of our two weeks rented. So we packed up last night and moved the entire poll over here. Jackson County Election Director Tammy Brown also says the decision to add a second early voting place so everyone didn't have to come to Independence came late in the game. Total knee replacement surgery. But for people like Marcelle Elverson, waiting on crutches for three and a half hours wasn't going to stop her from voting. It's a pivotal election and I had to be here. And so crutches or not, I was going to be here, right here, for as long as it takes. While Jackson County has two early voting locations, by contrast, Kansas City has seven. Election officials there tell us the longest wait times they're seeing in Casey Mo are about a half an hour. In Lee Summit, Andy Alcock, KNBC 9 News. Wow. Well, to find your early voting location, start with your county's election office website. Jackson County offers three satellite offices. The hours change daily, so make sure you check before you go. And for folks who live inside city limits, you cast your early vote through the Kansas City Election Board. They have six locations available. Both Clay and Cass counties have options, too. You can vote anytime leading up to Election Day at your county's location.